Nicole sat in place, feeling paralyzed. It was showtime. Where was everyone? She checked the cameras again, desperate, as one refreshing Instagram just in case a message had come through in the last 90 seconds. No such luck. Where could her co-host be? It was her show, of course. She knew that as well as anyone. And yet, and yet, he brought a certain je ne sais quoi to the whole affair. Loath as she was to admit it, perhaps he did bring a small amount of value to the show. But this was no time for reflection. This was a time for action. She steeled herself, resolving to move forward, and opened her mouth. But alas, in a crucial moment, she was blanking on the name of the show. Panic, she winged it with her best guess and welcomed the audience. Uh, hi everyone. Uh, welcome to Kelly's Basement of Horrors. Silence. Thundering, heart-rending silence. What now? She smiled broadly, as if this were all intentional. What could even be done? The obvious play would be to skip right to the guest. She checked the cameras again, another metaphorical look at a notification-free screen. She felt like a character in an old Taylor Swift song. Gut punch. She did her best to hide her disappointment, but it showed on her face, like the shame of a dog caught pissing on a priceless ornamental rug. How could the guest have forsaken her after all they'd been through together? And for what reason? Because they had to wash their hair today? It was all so much to process. Why, Lucas, why? The How realization that she had been sitting in silence, live on the stream, hit her with such great and terrible force that she yelped audibly. Yep. She knew she had to buy time. She knew she had to rope the audience in before they left. She began to hype up the evening's agenda, making ludicrous promises regarding the content that she could never possibly keep. Uh, yeah, so if you guys stay tuned, um, we're actually going to have uh, Oprah on um, any minute now. She's going to come on and she's going to do our giveaway and uh, everyone in the audience gets a gift. Um, it's totally fine. It's, uh, she's definitely not going to support any uh, problematic characters. It's, it's going to be great. She was exhausting herself. Her bag of tricks was empty. Why had she agreed to host this show? She worked backward through her life choices, regretting each decision in turn that she reckoned had led her to this point. She sank deep in her chair and deep into rumination. Only dimly did she remember that she had airtime to fill and instinctively began the longest um she could just to steal precious seconds. Um. This was it. No co-host, no guest, not even a producer. Her face wrinkled as she wrestled with the horror of the only choice left to her. Interact with the GM. Uh... <laughs> she reached anxiously to turn on his camera with a slowness that only served to drag out her suffering. But at long last, there he was, just sitting there, oblivious to anything going on, grinning like an idiot. She took a deep breath before daring to speak. He seemed to take no notice of her. Finally, backed into a corner, she greeted him with the same strained fake enthusiasm one would deploy when running into one's ex and their hot new partner at the dildo store when one was all alone. Uh, hey, Ian, what is up? Long time to see. <laughs> This, at least, seemed to get his attention. He greeted her back with the same sort of energetic bliss you'd expect from a squirrel at a birthday party. Well, hey there, partner. <laughs> how's, the, how's the chicken? And that was it. He stared at her with his beady little eyes, fixated on the camera in front of him like it was going to start talking to him. But it didn't. It just watched. And he watched back. The two of them just sat there a moment, unblinking. <laughs> But then, all of a sudden, blinking a lot, entirely too much blinking. She scrambled for something to ask him, when suddenly, out of the blue, he broke the silence on his own. Somewhere in that impenetrable meathead skull of his, a switch seemed to flip, 
and he looked dimly aware that he was a part of the show as well. Attempting to make small talk, he blurted out the most awkward question imaginable. Uh, shit much today? <laughs> make any big poops? <laughs> she, she forced a nervous chuckle, the sort of fake <laughs> chuckle that slaps you across the face with its hollowness. <laughs> she regretted it instantly. Even a terse, mm-hmm, mm-hmm, would have been less scathing. She quickly followed up with just such a noise, hoping it might cover up the prior response. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. <laughs> he looked completely unfazed either way. His goofy, thoughtless smile remained unbroken. She eventually answered in a way that she hoped would deflect the question completely. Oh, uh, yeah. That, uh, work, it just stop. <laughs> Once again, and his you? expression was unflinching. <laughs> If anything, he seemed to be grinning even more aggressively. She followed up with a small talk question on her own, which mortified her before she had even finished saying it. By God, it was twice as awkward as the one he just offered. <laughs> uh, how do you feel about abortion rights? Before she could retract it, however, he began to reply enthusiastically, uncomfortably enthusiastically. Oh, yeah. Just all of them. Just fucking go bananas. Just just chop, ch chop and drop them all, you know? <laughs> oh, if only he'd said that. That was her fantasy in that moment that he'd only just said that. <laughs> Instead, however, he said something an order of magnitude more unpleasant. Oh, yeah. I don't know. Uh, not really into it. <laughs> <laughs> She gritted her teeth through every uncomfortable nanosecond. Mercifully, though, it seemed like he was finished. Nicole managed exactly two and a half words in response before he launched with a profoundly unnecessary elaboration on what he'd just said, invoking barnyard animals in a way that she was sure had to be illegal in some places. When he finished, he just looked at her. Still grinning, eyes still piercing, like what he just said was normal, and not grounds for not being locked in a dungeon for a century. Well, <clears throat> I mean, a couple things come to mind about that whole, you know, situation. Um, and there's a really good anecdote from someone I've gained a lot of wisdom from. It involves lobsters, and I think it'll make Illings <laughs> a lot more clear. <laughs> oh, no! <laughs> she couldn't take it anymore. She broke. All she could manage were a series of syllables that could not be considered any human language, let alone English. Seriously, Jordan, are you... Fuck. You... <laughs> and that was it. Her tongue lolled out, head empty. No thoughts came. Is this what it was like to be him? It was pure joy, utterly sublime. <laughs> she could die in this moment and want for nothing. He waggled his eyebrows. He said nothing. Had she still the capacity to care, this new round of silence would have crushed her. Instead, it passed over her like verbal abuse passes over a goose. <laughs> Only the long-awaited appearance of her co-host finally broke this spell. All at once, a thousand emotions swelled through her, and they all fought for expression on her face at the same time. It was a chaos so biblical that some of the emotions seemed to splash over on the GM's face. <laughs> the co-host spoke calmly, as if none of this was of any import at all. Hey guys! How's it going? It's great to see ya! Nicole's fight-or-flight response triggered, and on this day there was no question of flight. Nicole didn't even have wings. Seeing the GM about to speak again, she leapt into action, cutting him off completely and letting out with whatever words came to mind. No contemplation, just action. Unfortunately, what came out was an unhinged and unfiltered rant about who really controls the media. Did you guys know? Nope. <laughs> <laughs> no what? Did you guys know that it's all ducks? There, that's why geese get such a bad rap, and that's why um, we have such bad body standards as women. Um, it's all controlled by ducks. They're just trying to 
uh, convince us all to go vegan and stop eating duck fat and uh, pate and uh, so they make us feel shitty for being uh, for gaining weight. That's foul. <laughs> I didn't Almost say you as spelled. foul as that joke. <laughs> so, yet somehow at the end of it all, something felt oddly right. Here they all were, alone with naught but each other and their thoughts, their hopes, their fears, their hang-ups, their barely repressed fetishes. Ooh. As the GM smiled blankly and the co-host spun an on-the-nose segue from her manifesto to the first segment of the evening, she settled into a strangely familiar feeling that everything was going to be okay. And speaking of... Or wait, I have to do that voice I was doing. What voice was I doing? Speaking of... Okay. <laughs> and speaking of uh, ducks... You know who can do great duck noises? Who? It's this guy. <laughs> Come here, duck. Yeah. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Want to hear my duck call? Yeah, I do. Come here, duck. <laughs> <laughs> Terrific. No notes. <laughs> All right. So it's now the, the duck noise segment. We don't we don't have a theme or anything for this, um, but I do think that uh, we could probably bring out our. Do you want me to play that and you guys can quack over it? No. Yeah. All right. Hell yeah. I want that. Oh, absolutely. Why would you'd be you'd be fucked up not to. So it was agreed. Uh, show sucks. We're flattening it, starting from scratch. And uh, we're going to do that with uh, segments because um, we've talked before about how segments are hack and bad. But it turns out we're hack and bad. <laughs> so it's right down our alley. Yeah. So this uh, this segment that we don't have a theme for is uh, it's the game show segment. And Ooh. what we should do is uh, I guess we could uh, shatter the uh, suspension of disbelief uh, and reveal that there are, in fact, many people here. Uh, Whoa, do you, oh, shit. What? Do you want to hit that f number one mute there so Sam can talk? <laughs> yeah. I'm the number one mute. <laughs> yeah, not the number one dead person. <laughs> you're, our, you're our favorite mute. You always have been. Thank you. Yeah, and uh, I th oh, I think Luke is far away. I have to tell him to come back. Oh, no, I'm here. I've been here all along. <laughs> oh, no, it was yeah, a trick. a reveal. It was a trick. Oh, Nicole, <laughs> oh you so must be fucking miffed, Nicole. He's been there the whole time. <laughs> this whole time. I've been Dang working, it. like, sitting here. Yeah, yeah, I've been sitting here working, just just doing my motion graphics. Well, now that you're here, um, what do you say we make you a deal that we trade you some of those motion graphics? Because as you can see, we're like sorely lacking in them. And you can have the the state of the art, like fully sound effects we're about to create on this game show. Ooh. Look, I do actually I do actually need Foley. So, uh, OK, we'll do that. We'll do that. <laughs> All right. That sounds perfect. Tight. So. Here's here's how I was thinking this would work. Uh, and here's our resident sound effects guy. All right. So what I've got is a list of. A list of lists of questions. Oh, good. Oh, fucking. That's my favorite. Type that of makes list. sense, right? Uh, OK, so there's eight questions. All right. And. Uh, we're, maybe we all need like a theater, sheet of paper or a whiteboard. A white wall. Yeah, do you want to write in the back of your character sheet? Oh, I'd love to. Yeah, all right. Let's do that. <laughs> and uh, I'll grab a piece of paper, too. All right, so do you do you two have sheet, shit you can write on? Oh, me? Uh, yes, I do. Yes, I do. Yeah. All right. So what's going to happen is I'm going to dart over there and I'm going to grab uh, a pen and paper. All right. But the, the conceit is that for each question, <laughs> there's three very similar sound effects. Um, but you decide mm -hmm. which one you want to do. 
Okay. And you'll make that sound effect, and then we'll all like lock in our guess of which one we think it is. Really? These are all very similar. They're extremely similar. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> like, you know, just if they seem different, just they're do like them. hauntingly identical. <laughs> like, oh, anyways, you're they're too them. identical. Yeah. Oh, yeah. They're too close. Well, yeah, you put totally. a little spin on it. No, no, no. I won't. It'll be fine. <laughs> Uh, yeah, so if anyone else wants to make duck noises while I grab that pen of paper. This is what I'm doing. Quack, quack. Hit you with the quack. Quack, quack. All right. Um, should we also introduce like our guests and who they are? Or no, no, no. no. <laughs> so we... I'm here, you can. Yeah. We're all people, <laughs> or are we? <laughs> or are, oh, who? We... I mean, we could be ducks at this point. <laughs> so actually, maybe we should introduce our guests because I only know who one of our guests is. <laughs> so like. <laughs> Oh, yeah, me. Right. yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm three ducks in a costume. That's right. Ah. Fucking <laughs> but you can call me Sam. Okay, cool. Is that an acronym for each of the ducks' names? Yes. <laughs> what, what are the, the three ducks' names? names? <laughs> it's an acronym for suck ass motherfucker. <laughs> Those are uh, the ducks' names. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> this is me. My name's Suck, and this is my brother, motherfucker. <laughs> and I'm ass. Suck the duck. <laughs> Suck the duck. <laughs> okay, yeah. so or there's also two ways I was thinking we could go about this. One is that I'm just an equal competitor with everybody else. Okay. Or the other being that uh, everybody gets like one lifeline where if they get stumped and they can't guess your thing, then I have to make it. Okay, so I'm just doing a sound effect and then everyone's guessing what it is. is yeah. That, okay. Actually, yeah, you know, I, I've got a structure. So basically, if once for the whole game, if anybody is totally stumped, once everyone else is locked in their answer, uh, you can nominate somebody else to look at the list and do the same, do the same noise. The same noise. Okay, cool. <laughs> That's fun. Okay. Sweet. Mm -hmm. So, uh, so pick one out of three of these and yeah. give her. So like, uh, make, I would say make the noise first, read us the three options and maybe make the noise again. Oh, okay. And they have to pick from the three. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. Oh, oh, hey, oh, hey, oh, um, oh. Are you still going, eh? <laughs> Honestly, bonus points if you can guess it before he reads the list. Okay, so, oh, uh, the first one is a wobbly wheel out of alignment. Uh, one of the three stooges stammering about a beautiful woman. Or Yogi Bear about to come. Oh, Yogi Bear, 100%. We'll, we'll, we'll all back. write in our answers privately. <laughs> oh. Yes, don't don't share these <laughs> Sorry. answers. Oh, I didn't know I didn't know it was multi choice, so I put like Hank Hill being surprised. <laughs> oh yeah, that's <laughs> which is also Hank Hill about to come as well. Yeah, very <laughs> simple. Well, you, I'm gonna bull. Do you want to make one more run at the sound now that we've heard the list? Yeah. <clears throat> hey! Oh! Oh! <laughs> Oh, hey, boo -boo, oh. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's well, that's definitely Hank Hill. Yeah, hundred percent. The wobbly wheel, I think. Oh. All right, lock in your answers. All right, we'll does everyone move on feel to, locked in? Feel locked in? Feel confident about that? Yep. Yeah. All right. Yep. Question number two, uh, or sound effect number two. Uh, I got to pick one, I guess. So your options are an adorable wooden toy train clacking along the train tracks, one of those ratchety lawn sprinklers, uh, a dog with long nails skittering along a hardwood floor. Can you do the sound effect one more time? Oh, classic dog sound. Yeah, right? <laughs> That's a dog about to come. <laughs> Beautiful. All right, lock, lock that shit in, folks, because we're, we're ripping. Uh, Are we not number asking three. how you would... Never mind. Go on. Oh, how I would what? How you would know if that's what a dog sounds like before they're about to come? Uh, <laughs> I mean, 
who doesn't Great. know what that's well, I mean, like Yogi, who, uh, who knows how yogi bear comes like well, I mean, you just gotta use your imagination what are you looking up on deviantart if not yogi bear yogi bear hentai weird rule 34 yeah R- yeah well i mean it gets old after a while well i feel like yogi, yogi bear, bear would make a different opens up the picnic basket and a bunch of tentacles just from flying out at him <laughs> oh yeah totally I feel... hey boo boo hey boo boo reach inside this basket <laughs> it's yogi i didn't think we were having hot dogs <laughs> <laughs> i feel like yogi bear would make a different noise if it was hentai though right like he's got to do his yogi bear like ahigao face oh yeah oh oh nani <laughs> <laughs> oh, boo boo! <laughs> hey, Oni Chan! Fuck, fuck, I'm sorry. You can drop me from the stream if you want. No, no, that's. I was great. just sitting there, just like, how bleak do I go? <laughs> bleak. Hey, boo boo. How much hey, do baka. I reveal that I know about hentai? <laughs> <laughs> hey, listen, we've got all the time in the world. You can keep going. Wait, I'll, I'll do the, the, the voice of voice. <laughs> Lucas kept going despite everyone's averting their gaze and not knowing what to say. <laughs> Sorry. Yeah, yeah, it was. Do the Asiago face. No more Australian Gothic people. <laughs> uh, yeah, oh, my so co host might see this. You got here. Now, I thought you were going to play him a little more similar than you did on the last one. Sorry? N- never mind. What, you want no me notes. To- You're doing great. Okay. All right. Well, I mean. Make it hard. We've got to make it hard. Okay, make it harder. Yeah, it got to be challenging. All right, all right. That's what she um, said. Is it? Oh. <laughs> hey, Otherwise, we're all going to have eight points. And, Beautiful. You know, no, that's, who are that's we going to yell fun. at and make fun of if somebody doesn't lose? Oh, okay. Oh. Well, this one's this one's hard. Okay. <laughs> oh, no, I mean, that's so easy that's to get. also just anti Yogi Bear, isn't it? <laughs> okay, so your options are. So the are laugh a is not part of that. That was just. <laughs> <laughs> no, the laughing, you, it could be. Uh, air rushing through a duct without a vent cover. <laughs> or an alien obelisk glowing with dark energy. Oh. <laughs> Can you do it again for us, please? <laughs> waterfall <laughs> oh, sorry okay next one just take your time answering that don't you know <laughs> i feel like some of these are trick questions you're setting us up for can i get, can uh, I get a spelling for the word obelisk uh yes absolutely um, r-b-e-l for no, for no reason oh, i'm not e-l-o <laughs> for a friend uh e-l-i-s-k obelisk are you writing down like full length answers i was just putting like abc Oh, I was writing it down. Oh, what look the first at you guys. That? I'm not going to remember what ABC A- is. A-N-C. ABC, yeah. Obelisk? Obelisk. O B E L. An, an obel. Like o- oval, but with a. No, not at all, actually. No. <laughs> it's like 50% like an oval. Almost oh, uh, bonus points for spelling obelisk correctly. I, I can literally read the question right there. But oh, yeah, okay. Well, I mean, points. sometimes you just you get the wins and you take them. She's, uh, she's the producer. She's got it all going on the monitor. Oh, this. OK, this is going to be harder. I promise. OK. I think you should do that a little so, closer to the mic just to make sure everyone heard you. <laughs> <laughs> I can still hear it. <laughs> You're when I go to well, it. get ready for the sound because you know what it is, folks. Uh, a dog licking peanut butter from a toy. What good pussy sounds like. Um, or a farmer currying through the bog in rubber boots. <laughs> Can we hear that sound one more time? <laughs> Do I get bonus points if I spell good pussy correctly? <laughs> <laughs> But of course. Yeah, you have to include the but dollar signs. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, it better be. So- Actually, both of us are spelling it more U- incorrectly. D. <laughs> Damn it. Yep, I feel yep. like that right, question there made answer so much about you when you reveal it. <laughs> nah, that's very true, actually. <laughs> you know what good pussy sounds like? <laughs> Just such an odd way to <laughs> enjoy the, the senses of the pussy. That uh, was right. actually the, the last question. <laughs> yes, that's right. 
おおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおはい。Uh, racist. <laughs> <laughs> well, it can't be that because I feel like I would have heard some slurs in the middle of that. <laughs> oh, yeah. Let's get that sound one more time. No, go off the first one. Yeah, well, you're working hard over there. I know. Yeah, buzzing and. And chopping up kids or uh, chopping up bodies, electrocuting kids. <laughs> Thanks for the clarification. Yeah, you don't want to mix those up. You don't want to chop up kids and electrocute dead bodies. Like, no, no. There's no point to electrocuting a dead body. Well, what if you're trying to, you know, bring them bring back to life, you know, good old, good old uh, monster style. Yeah, Frankenstein. Yeah. Well, for every person you bring back to life, like Frankenstein, that's really like karmically one child you can elect, you can cut up with a bandsaw. Right. Yes. <laughs> It's a take one, take a thing, leave a thing situation. Mm -hmm. All right. You guys ready for the next one? Mm -hmm. uh, I'm ready to move on from the electrocuting children bit. So. Oh, are you ready? Okay. <laughs> Get this rolling. Yeah. I love how we I drilled on that one. What basically all of the answers for the next three are. Uh, oh, nice. Uh -huh. Okay. I'm going to mix one a little harder. Ah. <laughs> Ready for that again? Yep. Oh. <laughs> oh. And oh, <laughs> and that's either a dungeon a dungeon door that has never been oiled, a very old cat being hugged too hard, or a rooster that got into the moonshine. <laughs> I thought that was you coming. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh <yeah. laughs> so, this is the sound. One more time. Oh. <laughs> Sounds like that tree from the last unicorn. <laughs> oh, oh. No, oh, yeah, not. the horny, the <laughs> super horny tree. Yes. <laughs> That's what good pussy sounds like. Oh. Oh. <laughs> oh. 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 <laughs> It's like just being very bashful, but in a very, <laughs> very rich way. Oh. All hey, right, you got it? You got it, folks? Got it. Got it. We so got you it. were scrolling all over the place. Like the questions are in order. It's, it's really straightforward. Okay. Well, actually, there's a uh, little stickies that I'm trying to like <laughs> rub yeah. off. Oh yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's a pretty sticky tablet. Um, yeah. <laughs> you're not the only Why one trying the to rub off. So, so sticky. I, that's a great question, Kelly. Um, uh, okay. All right. Here's the next I one. To pass on this one. Okay. No, no, I got it. Again. That's a farmer walking through a dry field. <laughs> And that's either a cool drum solo heard from below the stage, an oversized, unbalanced dryer load, uh, a space engine that won't turn oversized. That won't turn oversized? What does that mean? Uh, I think it's supposed to be a spaceship engine that won't turn over. Ah, yes. So what you're saying is you didn't understand that bullet point. No, no. I, okay. I was like, well, I'm definitely guessing that one. <laughs> oh, yes. Okay. Uh, you got your answers to that? Because I want to do the next one. Yep. I mean, don't worry. We'll get there. All right. Last one. <sighs> Fuck, you're going to make me do this. I hate you. <laughs> And that's either Crazy Frog 
Not to labor the moonshine. good pussy bit. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> This is terrible. Uh, I know we've got a lot of mileage out of it, but... <laughs> yeah, yeah, I mean, it it's... You said one more time. It's a, One more time? Really? Do I have to do it again? <laughs> Did no one oh, hear I mean, That's what's important to <laughs> understand about yes, Pussy Lucas, is that no matter how much mileage you get out of it, <sighs> it's still just as good as the first time. You, you're going to have to That's just <laughs> dig deep from junior high. I'm sure we all remember, because all, all of the options are Crazy Frog. <laughs> Uh, it's either Crazy Frog that got into the moonshine, Crazy Frog being ex- electrocuted, or Crazy Frog also about to come. I'm going to answer this based on what I think you would have liked to have done the most. Mm. Mm. I mean, I, I'm going to wait till I hear it again. I'm, I'm a good playing a cautious game. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that's it. <laughs> just dying that's it folks <laughs> all right so are you gonna go Beautiful. through an order and we'll just kind of keep our own scores honor system or what yeah yeah honor system you know we're all honorable people everyone hand your sheet to the left <laughs> <laughs> yeah. so like some trick photography yeah i'll just, just like, i'll yeah. fax it to one <laughs> of you cool <laughs> oh yeah there we Show. go. Yeah. <laughs> wait, you're over here. I don't know why that's complicated. Oh, oh, no, but. Oh, wait, I should have. Magic! Wow! 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 Ooh, wow. And that's Pretty email, wow. folks. Damn, this wide frame. <laughs> this is the metaverse. This is an eye of legs and shit, and Mark Zuckerberg <laughs> is not really awful to look at anymore. Yeah, if this was a metaverse oh, wow. show, we could just be standing around watching him do these noises, but then we could pass our little digital sheets. Oh, how fun. Oh, so true. We finally we could, figured it we out. We could the all be go right Yogi Bears up. with huge tits. Like, we could. Be oh, yeah. Man. That'd be Best great if we were all Yogi Bear with giant tits. <laughs> <laughs> Just a horde of them. One day. One I day. mean, there's still time to change our character sheets for the game. Oh, that's very true. Have everyone be Yogi I'm Bear. a bear with ginormous boobs. <laughs> I, I like that character. Oh all right. Let's run through this. See who is the, the smartest person. Uh, question number one was Yogi Bear about to come. Was that C? That was C. Okay. Well, now you've hacked it. Oh, now C you're now you're come. you're funny fella. Because I didn't read them in order every time. I know, I know. The, that's why I started writing them. But the first two, I don't. Yeah. So that's Yogi Bear about to come. Uh, the second one was one of those ratchety lawn sprinklers. Yes. Oh, yeah. Yes. See, I thought you were just gonna do the ratchet part, the- <laughs> which is the part that sounds like the other two. <laughs> Right, yeah, but lawns, that's an iconic sound. The yeah, lawn the sprinkling sprinkler. did give it away. Yeah, well, it was a lawn sprinkler. Uh, <laughs> the reason why I gave it away is it was it. Because it's what it was. It's because it was it was. Uh, number three uh, was an alien obelisk glowing with oh, dark yeah. energy. Yes. Number four was a farmer hurrying through the bog in rubber boots. Hell yeah. I thought oh, it was damn a peanut it. butter dog. Uh, yeah. <laughs> I guess I, this is, I thought it was This is when I actually started trying to make it more vague. Look, uh, I want to hear it one more time just in case. Like, yeah. I think you're... See, that's like a really, like... Excellent. He'd be a really short farmer, though, because, like, how quick his steps are going together. Well, he's nice. actually a farmer hurrying through the bog in rubber boots. <laughs> okay, okay. Yeah, so... Hence the, the urgency and the rhythmic nature of the squishes. Gotcha. Uh, number five was a B on cocaine. What? You Damn fuck. The, the laugh. I, I told you to ignore the laugh. No, I went with the bandsaw one. Oh, oh, well, there you go. Dummy. Uh, <laughs> number six was. Uh. Oh, oh, this one. This was uh, this was actually a very old cat being hugged too hard. Yes. Fuck. Oh, yes. Oh, God damn it. Oh. Number seven was uh, an oversized, unbalanced dryer load. Yes. Hell yes. Thank God, I'm back in business. <sighs> um, and number eight was Crazy Frog about to come. God damn. Fucking knew it. He seems oh, so it. distressed, though. Yeah, well, yeah, he's he's a stressy <laughs> guy. Yeah. He kind of oozes stress. All gas, no brakes. He's about to ooze. Yeah. <laughs> I'm, I'm crazy frog about to come. There's a lot coming in this. 
Actually, just a decent amount. Two questions. It's just the right amount, I think. Yeah. We just kept talking about it. <laughs> right. Yes. Oh, well, how'd everyone do? I got five. Seven. Got six. Oh, shit. Three. Seven. What did you get? Lucas? What did you get? Uh, three. Uh, oh, right. Well, the three, we all know the rules. Stuff. Won that one. We all know the rules. The uh, loser of the game has to, you know, be kicked off the stream and leave forever. So, oh, how dare you? Also, probably good because my son is crying in the next room. I should go see what's going on there. <laughs> yeah, somebody might be electrocuting him. <laughs> Finally, he. No. <laughs> <laughs> all right. If you guys liked Lucas's good pussy jokes, um, you can find him on Osgoth Pod. <laughs> His good, good pussy jokes. <laughs> This Those is are some good as you can expect from my stupid podcast. <laughs> <laughs> no, your you your co-host is going to love it. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. She she will absolutely watch this. <laughs> uh, so are you going to officially kick me from the stream or do I just have to leave and turn? Oh, I was off? giving you an out. You know, we were oh, going to okay. do it on the Sorry. sly, remember? <laughs> oh, OK. I thought I was going to go like, no. And you like, you know, you kick me from the stream. But yeah, we should have. I don't know how easy too. it is. Magic of special. We can probably right. splice that. Can... You just did it, so we can make it, we can make it work. That'd be cool. Yeah. Quickly, <laughs> uh, Kelly, no, say something no, disparaging. No. <laughs> Nailed oh. it. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Thank God good. you're here, Nicole. Well done. I do my best. All right. All right. Bye, Lucas. Thanks. Bye. <laughs> All right. Well, we did it. <laughs> It's 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 funny how uh, despite everything you told me about not forcing people to do improv, uh, all of our prepared segments so far have involved forcing people to do improv. Yeah, but you know, it's, it's structured improvisation. Okay. You know? And speaking of structured improvisation, oh, shall we speak of it? Yeah, I also was I was going to try and like you Nicole to play the little noise, and I once again forgot it's in that hard drive on the floor. What's the noise? Uh, it goes. But we gotta do is a barnyard animal. Oh right. Yeah. What's your third favorite barnyard animal, Nicole? Um, probably a horse. What if we were all just a an orchestra of barnyard animals? Oh yeah, yeah. That's the way to do it. It's not. It's not good. Doubles those. Make sure it's as chaotic as possible. Yeah, so like I'll do. Uh, um, who who wants to do that low? Ba -ba 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 -ba. I'll be a pig. Yeah. You're <laughs> <laughs> gonna be able to keep that up the whole time. <laughs> oh, yeah, I'm gonna try. <laughs> All right. I'm well, gonna be. Uh, do we have to not use the ones we already did? I'm gonna, There's I'm gonna only be a so chicken. many animals yeah, in the barn. That's true. Wait, I'll be I'll be a sheep. I can do that that melody. Okay. That sheep melody. Yeah. All right. What are you gonna be, Sam? Uh, what's left? I lives in a barn. Tigers. And some. You be a some, goat. Some like a goat. Yeah. But does a goat? This, like, what's the difference between like? I know what the difference is between like a goat and a sheep sound wise. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I feel <laughs> like it's, it's <laughs> versus bat. Yeah. <laughs> gotcha. Okay. Yeah. I will do goat. We could use a goose. I mean, they're not like part of the farm, but they're probably there. We could use a goose. Yeah. You could do the hiss, Nicole, you know? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I, yeah. Nice. I was going to go boring and do a chicken because I think I can balk for 10 minutes and I think I'd be my vocal cords still be intact. So it's 10 minutes what we're doing. Oh, geez. What? For 10 minutes, eh? <laughs> no, right. Save me from having to run you this game. You guys didn't practice for the 10 minute bard yard animal course? I did, but after... Two minutes of oinking, I fucking <laughs> nearly died. I I said, are you gonna be able to do the I'm pig? gonna I'm gonna be able to do it, man. It's okay. <laughs> uh all right. Let's uh let's do it. Five, six, seven, eight. <laughs> 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 uh, that was horrible. That was a terrible.
terrible thing to try and do. That's that's far worse than any of the like ASMR shit we've done so far. Oh yeah. Barnyard ASMR. <laughs> no. I can't wait for you to like splice that together into the like and replace the yeah. original song. That'd be great. It's the GM. It's me. Look at me. I am the GM now. Oh, behold how the tables have tabled. The tables are always tabling. <laughs> and we're back. Welcome to hour four of Barnyard Noise Time. <laughs> we're coming back. I don't know why it's like a radio guy. Shit. Well, that's not bad. Thank you. Welcome. <laughs> Are you? Yeah, just just navigate the maze of shit. <laughs> you do it again when I go past the microphone. <laughs> no, it's too late. Anyone else? <laughs> Such an upsetting. Me? I forgot about the donkey. That's a that's a deeply that's a upsetting noise. Yard. That's a hard one to do <laughs> again and again, though. Okay. Yeah, why don't you see how N Nicole did the longest hee haw hee haw that she could in order to buy time? Oh. Nicole heed so that we was could that was not <laughs> the longest hee haw that I can. <laughs> she he on my haw till I last haw. <laughs> cowboy. Santa's rooting this cowboys for his tooting his problems. <laughs> All right. <laughs> yes, Santa does do that. <laughs> Nicole, you got your character sheet and shit? Um, yeah, I totally have it, and everyone else should go first for no reason. Cool. All right. I'll go first. Wait, aren't you going to... Do we introduce the story, or we just introduce our That's characters? That's right. And... No, I was just... I was, you know, giving Nicole a little prompt before I started the story. So... Oh, okay. All of you, I will stress, canonically, do not know each other. You are not all a secret family. <laughs> Okay. Yeah, we got to get that out of the way this time. <laughs> okay. Uh, each of you have woken up in a. I, I'm gonna call it's sort of like a. It looks like a, a d disused bathroom. Oh. Mm. And. Uh, so it's like very clean, or like it hasn't been used. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> it's you are in the most immaculately clean bathroom you've ever been in. All right. And <laughs> wow, uh, fuck, this place is clean. Yeah, it's clean, but it's not in good shape. Mm. So like tiles are all smashed. It's round and <laughs> it's a sphere. <laughs> it's, it's a dome. All right. OK, cool. You don't think that's a good shape for a bathroom? No. OK, because <laughs> you can only pee from the middle when you're standing up. <laughs> it's a low dome. Really good okay, yes. Acoustics, though. Oh, like it's oh, it's yes. like you mean like sort of like a dome where everyone stands in the middle and pisses outward into like a trough? Yeah, yeah like an Oryx and Creek. Yeah. Oh, yeah. actually, that's kind of nice. That's like those little the uh, little piss vestibules they used to have at Astral Harvest. You remember those? Uh, no. Oh, because I just ran into the forest. All right. Fucking weirdo. <laughs> All right. All right. So we're in this uh, na this not nasty bathroom, but haggard. It, it looks like it keeps. Uh, it, it's been misused, but also cleaned repeatedly. Mm, OK, like a saw bathroom. No, no, Not nothing that, that nothing no, that nothing uh, so obvious. Yeah, we, we wouldn't be that hack. OK, uh, and uh, Is there a bathtub. You are all handcuffed to each other. Oh, mm. and oh, that line. not the first time I've woken up like this. Am I right? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Are you right? Tell us about it. <laughs> Yeah, that was a joke, because I get it. I get lots. If you know what I mean. <laughs> no, I don't. Can you elaborate? <laughs> I uh, like to take the ladies for a mustache ride. If you're getting... If you're, you smelling what I'm stepping in. <laughs> smelling what I'm stepping in? <laughs> Dog shit? <laughs> 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 no, good pussy, my man. Oh, yeah, that's right, yeah. brother. Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> hey, what does that sound like again? <laughs> uh, well, I haven't like... actually done well, it Well, let's yet. all go around the room and let's just <laughs> yes. go with our, give our own example. Uh, you know, it sounds like... Ooh. Ooh, ooh. <laughs> <laughs> it sounds like... Ooh, 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 ooh. Ooh, ooh, ooh. <laughs> ooh, ooh, ooh. <laughs> 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 good. 
Mm-hmm. Good. <laughs> oh boy. Mm-hmm. <laughs> oh great. <laughs> That's it. Are you done? That was a good yeah. <laughs> so um, I don't have a good luck one. I'm just gonna have you each roll roll two dice, and uh, whoever has the lowest number is the person who is chained in the middle. Can you put the little board here? No, that's the dice cam. It's got to be. Oh, we got to turn oh, on the Nicole. Can you cam. turn on the dice cam? Cool. Uh, yep. Hey, Ian. Dice cam is on. And since Josh isn't here to yell at us, can you make the dice cam like the main one? Oh yeah. So I got the lowest. Okay. Oh, you got the, you got the <laughs> yeah, old I thing, guys. All right. Almost guarantee it. All right, flawless. So you're you're chained up in the middle, and uh, who got the second lowest? We're rolling a single d6. Yeah, yeah. You go ahead and roll one. I got. I got a one. Oh. All right. Oh. So she got oh, less than yeah, two. Right on, yeah. She only and rolled I, one. And then I just rolled a second one. So. <laughs> All right. Well, you, you took the longest to get there. So uh, here, here's the order that you're chained in. Um, So you got the best one, Sam? Yeah, I did. So you're chained on one end and then next to you in the middle is Nicole. And then next to her is a very affable Australian man with kind of like curly black hair. And he, he's kind of nerdy looking, you know, he looks as bewildered as any of you. and um, and then on the end is you. All right. Yeah. Cool. So why don't you introduce who your characters are and we'll maybe see if we can figure out how you got here. All right. Uh, my name is Hubert Waterbridge. I, I, I look I look striking, strikingly normcore. <laughs> like I'm wearing like a polo um, and slacks. And uh, should I give my background now? Or? Yeah, like give your full introduce what of your character you want to okay. introduce. Yeah, I'm like a high society trust fund baby. Everything's been given to me, including my marriage to a degree. You got married to a degree? <laughs> my marriage <laughs> to a degree. You just, you just <laughs> love your diploma so much. That's right. Like, yeah. And uh, uh, you can probably gather this, but my unique talent is I'm rich. <laughs> OK, yeah, that's a great talent. I wish I had that one. Yeah. And that's me. All right. Let's move on down to your character next. Sorry, what was your, what was your name? Uh, Hubert Waterbridge. All right. Okay, so that's Hubert. Next All up. right. Um, I'm going to be Clarence B. Butterson. I am a stunningly <laughs> handsome southern gentleman with a drumstick bolero. I'm from an illustrious family in the Deep South, the scion of the Kentucky Fried Chicken Empire. Or at least I was. Oh, uh, my unique talent is that I have can take a small sip of brown soup. That's a side of gravy, and it powers me up a little bit. Helps me think. Oh, nice. <laughs> it's like limitless, but with gravy. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Beautiful. And who's our final participant here? Uh, so my name is uh, Joe. Um, and I... <laughs> No last name. <laughs> Sorry, what? No last name, just Joe. Uh, yeah, no, it's uh, Joe Mama. <laughs> Fucking got him! Oh, shit! Oh, 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 shit. It. Uh, I am a douchebag uh, that works in the mall. <laughs> no. <laughs> um, I work at uh, Spencer's in the mall. Um, I sell... Nice. Yeah. <laughs> I smell. I smell. Uh, I smell. Yeah. <laughs> That's you. And you're articulate I, to boot. I, uh, what do you do for a living? I stink. Oh, I smell. <laughs> Hell yeah. Um, yeah, I sell shitty um, joke gifts that nobody wants or needs um, for a living. Um, I'm from Iowa. I don't know. <laughs> my secret talent is that we're in Iowa uh, <laughs> the town the mall there's only one so the town mall uh, <laughs> that's the name the of the town the, ta- the town with the mall um, oh the town with the oh, mall of yeah, course, yeah. which of is course. actually yeah. not town yeah. mall no, no. <laughs> um, yeah so I uh, my special talent is um, 
my absolute um, <laughs> huge amount of confidence <laughs> that I, oh, I like, say, like, have not earned on. in any way. <laughs> 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 yeah, but what do you think the huge amount of confidence is based on? Oh, right, yes. Uh, yeah. What do you call somebody from Iowa? Iowanian. Iowan? A douchebag, didn't you hear? <laughs> yeah, <right>. Joe. <laughs> okay. All right. <clears throat> I was really hoping so, I could drag out the Joe Mama joke. I was waiting. I was hoping that it would be like halfway into the game and someone would be like, what is your last name? And I'd be like, Joe Mama. But. Uh, sorry. <laughs> I go. Too inquisitive. God. Okay, sorry. You know what to say. I'm ready for the show. <laughs> All right. So the uh, the four of you are uh, are are standing there, and your hand you're you're kind of one arm each, handcuffed to each other, and dangling from chains uh, in the ceiling above you. There is uh, on one chain there is a Santa hat. On another chain there is a bear trap. <laughs> Uh, on another chain, there is a spork. And on another, there is uh, a toy dinosaur. All right. And those are those are dangling above your head. And on the on the ground in each it's a square room and there's an object in each corner. And you see uh, in, in one corner, Lube, uh, in another corner, Vicodin, in another corner, Peanut Butter. Sounds like my <laughs> kind of party, am I right, fellas? All right. <laughs> hey, who? I do say, it looks like we're in for a smashing time. Say your character <laughs> voice. Yes. <laughs> okay. <laughs> And in the uh, last corner, there is. Um, uh, I'm going to say like a, a little like a mini like scythe, like a farming implement. OK, and what was the other thing hanging from the roof? So the Santa hat, the dinosaur and a bear trap, a bear trap. and a, uh, a spork, plastic spork. Oh, it's plastic. And are we like in the middle of the room? Kind of. Or? Yeah, you've kind of woken up in the middle you're you you're you're laying on your backs and you are uh you're you're handcuffed to each other and that's that's what you know okay. all right are we handcuffed to anything else in the room or are we just all handcuffed together um what's your uh what's your perce- are you good or bad at perception i uh i have a medium all right you're just normal yeah just normal all right so just roll two dice and tell me how that goes all right seven <laughs> Um, you, you notice that, uh, the, the, the other, the other man, the very quiet Australian man, there looks like there's a little chain running up his pant leg and it is, <laughs> yeah, it's hooked into, uh, it's, it, it kind of go disappears down a grate, like a drain in, so in the floor from his wrist to up his pant leg. And then, no, it's not connected to his wrist. Oh, OK. Oh, Ooh. oh, it seems we have another member in shackles. <laughs> <laughs> and I kind of like look at I, was, I look at him and I'm, I point at the his wiener. <laughs> and uh, it looks down <laughs> and he goes, oh, member, uh, like his like his wiener. Is, yeah, 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 member yeah, is like he, another word is like a hoity toy word for a dick. He. Uh, Good Someone way, appreciates comedy. <laughs> he looks down and uh, embarrassed. He tries to like cover his dick and go no, and uh, and but he 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 can't. So he pulls it. Whoever I said he was attached to, yeah, which I, I guess is Nicole and you. Yes. All right. So he kind of yanks you guys, but he can't quite cover it. Um, but he's he fervently denies that it's attached. Oh, he's to like his pulling dick. me to his his wiener. Yeah. Let's do names first before we get too excited. I'm uh, Hubert Waterbridge, and who might you be? Uh, he says, oh, uh, Bruce. No last name? Mama. No! <laughs> and when he starts what? trying to flex on you, like, oh, Bruce, Mama. Uh, it's, it's some, like, weird Australian joke you don't understand. <laughs> Expect this degree of comedy from the 
the the prison <laughs> prison planet of Australia. <laughs> And he he's he's just kind of like he's still trying to like touch down dance. He's not listening to you. <laughs> he feel like he feels like he's already won. <laughs> well, well, I do declare it feels good to be at the front of the centipede again. What are you guys? Why are we here? <laughs> I feel like you're at the side of the centipede, but no, it's the front. <laughs> and you hear a noise that sounds like an intercom, but it kind of just sounds like an intercom being fumbled, like. <laughs> Hold it a fist away from your mouth. <laughs> and uh, there, there's a, there's I'm like a long pause. I'm told you're supposed to hold it like you're sucking a dick. <laughs> <laughs> Both are correct. Oh my, so uncouth. <laughs> my stars. <laughs> and you hear a voice that goes, uh, Hello, is, is this better? Can you hear me now? Oh no. Quite, quite well. And now I demand. Uh, no, sorry. <laughs> so I demand to know what's going on immediately. <laughs> yes, I'm sorry. I'm just as confused as you. I, I don't seem to know how I got here, but there's a lot of levers and there's a, a lot of buttons. And oh dear, oh, I, I can't find the exit. Do you know where my hotel is? Hotel? I'm at the resort. Uh, so was I. The. What was the name of it again? Well, I can't remember. It was something ethnic. You know how those words are. Oh, yeah. Put me on the spot. <laughs> was everyone else at the resort as well? No, I don't remember. <laughs> <laughs> well, you I were... was just making chicken. <laughs> <laughs> you all seem I very recall. nice, but you all look very busy. So I'll, I'll leave you all to it. I'm sure I can find my way out. And you hear like the what? intercom hang up. No, whoa, 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 don't whoa, hey, leave. lady. Hey, hey, w woman on the other side of the mic. Uh, why don't you hang around for a bit and we can chat and get to know each other? You know, it's like Paul Simon says, there's 50 ways to love your lever. So why don't you just pull <laughs> some of those levers and see what happens? Baby. No, don't be so rash. We seem to be prisoners and levers and prisoners. Oh, hey, don't he told you, who told you about my rash? Wait, what? No. <laughs> Nothing. <laughs> Never mind. Dirty man talking to me. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> All right. Yeah, you definitely have a rash like where the handcuff is on your wrist. Like maybe it's been there for a bit. But I kind of like it. <laughs> now, Bruce, we are all classically shackled, as you can see. And I kind of like shackle, shake my shackles. I'm like, what? I demand to know why you have been shackled at the cock. <laughs> no, no, take off his pants. No. <laughs> and he he's he tries to hold up his pants like instinctively. Um, or so you're attached to him. Yes. OK, so are you going to are you going to what are you going to try to are you going to try to do it? Or are you just threatening it? I'm just threatening to do it. OK, so he's pulling you and he's really trying to hold on to his waistband. Wait, just to just to kind of. So who's at the very end of this chain of people again? I believe that's you're at the you're I'm at, at the, the far end. Yeah. You're on the other Bruce side the of. And then Bruce is at the very far Joe. end. So then and then we know that Bruce is attached by his dick as well as his hands to people on either side. Correct. I would say no is a strong word. I don't know that you know that. It but could the chain's going to his pants. He has said that oh, you just decided Bruce is attached, that. and Bruce has said no, but I feel like either of them you have to take their word for it. I think it's up his butt, and we're going to have to use a tool to get it out. Oh. That was Whoa, my Oh, hey, talking. ho. My uh, frat was forced to take a con uh, consent course, and uh, I think we're going to have to ask for his permission to do that. Um, Bruce, how do you feel about that? Are we cousins, by the way? Peasants? Bruce? To me, yes, you're all peasants. <laughs> no, I said Bruce. Are we pre are we cousins? No, I I emphatically <laughs> stated that you are not related to each other. <laughs> yeah, but then we've got the last same name, so like. Oh yes, that is true. Hmm. Surely yeah, you well, must be related. Ma Mama's like Smith <laughs> in this alternate reality. Uh, <laughs> it's kind of real. everyone's last name. Uh. Bob Mama. So the other. Oh, wait, no. So Joe is also in the middle. Who's the other one on the end? You are. OK, I'm at the front. I had to write it down to keep him straight for myself. Um, right, can, I can I take a little I'm gonna, can I take a little look see around the room? Can I kind of see what I. See yeah. How's I your see? perception? Are you good or bad at it? 
Um, I am nothing at perception. So. All right, so you just roll two dice and tell me what you got. Uh, a four. Uh, a you four. notice that the there's there's actually a little like speck of mud on one of the tiles in front of you. Oh, you didn't notice that before, but you do, you notice it now. Oh wow! <laughs> <laughs> well. I do declare. And you hear a, you hear like a ticking noise start in the background. Oh, I look at the ticking noise. You, you look just at hear the... it. It kind of oh, oh, reverberates okay. through the bathroom. <laughs> you look at it. <laughs> well, I thought it would be a clock of some sort. Anyways, <laughs> well, I am very persuasive. I went to college, so uh, I'm going to try and persuade Bruce to uh, take off his pants. <laughs> I'm going to obtain consent. You're good at persuasion? Yes. All right, well, then roll all of it. Bruce, look, it seems like we're on a timer of some sort, and you're the only one who's shackled differently than us. Maybe it's a clue. A clue. No, you roll all of it, because if you're good at it, you can roll the oh, advantage. Well, I mean, uh, plus two. No, no, you just you oh, roll with advantage, which is nine. a better pair. Nine. Okay. Yeah, so with a nine, he's he he kind of starts to relax his grip around his belt, and he's like... Oh, I don't don't know. Don't know. <laughs> I, I, who? Wh what do you want me to do here? There's but, nothing around my. Just he talks in this weird voice for some reason. <laughs> there's, there's nothing around my dick. Son, there's no need to be embarrassed. Just take down your pants. That's right. This could be important. Wouldn't you like to know why? This makes me deeply uncomfortable. Is there something that could make you a bit more comfortable? Perhaps a uh, a toy dinosaur. Yeah. Would it make you feel better to cuddle the dinosaur? I, I mean, possibly a little bit, but it's it's like 10, 10 feet up. How are we going to get it? I will get that dinosaur for you if you take off your pants. Fair's fair. That's kind of Not... consent, right? <laughs> we can use your trousers to swat at it. <laughs> I'm not going to lie to you. This makes me deep, deeply uncomfortable. And uh, he's <laughs> now we don't want to resort to violence, do we? <laughs> so he starts like slowly pulling his pants down. And as he gets like just to his like hip bones, uh, you notice that there's uh, like kind of like a belt, like a metal belt around his actual waist. Like a chastity that there's belt? a little chain <laughs> attached to it's a little chastity belt. <laughs> uh, you know what? You're you're seeing, you know, just like a band around his hips. Of steel? Um, you're not sure what metal it is. It looks like metal. You should bite it to see if it's gold. Here I go. <laughs> you're gonna go bite it? Yes. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Well, why don't you roll resilience here? Resilience. Yeah. Hmm. All right. Were you normal at that? Normal. <laughs> All right. You uh, you you bite it, and you can tell right away it's metal, and you kind of back off. Yes, it is metal. It actually, you see, what was the metal you said? Steel? Steel. It's definitely steel. Wow. You know steel when you bite it. That's right. Yeah. <laughs> so you've solved that mystery. That's great. God damn. We're making progress, folks. <laughs> and so, uh, yeah. so he's just got a steel belt on? Yeah. I do say, Bruce, is this a normal garment that you adorn your hips with? No. Hmm. <laughs> That's different. And uh, he he starts saying, I think I think we should try to get out. Yeah, that's what, what we're trying to figure out. But you're such a fucking you're being so difficult about your pants right now. I would pick a direction of walking. Oh, is there any doors or anything in this room? Um, there's uh, <laughs> we asked yeah, 20 minutes into the game. <laughs> yeah. Oh, there's the door. Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, at uh, at one at the wall that's behind you, there's a uh, there's like a what looks like the you know swinging double doors like on a gymnasium, no. even though here in a bathroom. You mean a saloon? And is uh, our... okay. There's there's screws like you can see screws poking through it. Like it looks like it was bolted shut from the outside. Oh. Great. Is it is the lady in, uh, on the other side of the microphone still there? And you hear another uh, sound through the intercom. Uh, y yes, hello, it's me again. How I listen. And he, she sees that you're like trying to like bite this guy's bell. And she's like, I really don't want to interrupt. I just, uh, you know, I think that uh, I, 
I might have found the way out. And uh, there's what, what are you what are you guys doing right now? Do, can you do you have a minute? We are biting the Australian. <laughs> Sure, and I'm, I, I just finished, <laughs> so yes, we have some time. Okay, well, what I figured out is I think that uh, th there's a lot of these uh, levers, and some of them are marked with uh, they are all marked with different emojis. So uh -huh. there's one that's a uh, crying, laughing emoji. <laughs> <laughs> I love that one. And there's there's a uh, uh, what? Oh, I just said I really like that one. Okay. <laughs> I use it often. Um, yeah, there's also a uh, a poop emoji. Hmm, another good one. And there's one that has a uh, that you kind of like grimace. That's like these are. Well, you can't you can't see what she's doing. You just hear <laughs> right. you just hear a pause. Can we hear that awful sound of like when someone smiles and you just kind of hear their like <laughs> teeth? That <laughs> yeah and uh the last one is uh it's an upside down face hey what do you all think the upside down face means i never understood i thought it was like oh hello i'm in the southern hemisphere but people get confused <laughs> it's 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 normal side up for australians uh whoopsie this is what i took it to mean i guess we gotta pull a lever fuck it sure pull that one <laughs> The upside downsies. Yeah, uh, you why know not? what? We have uh, we have lots of T-shirts at Spencer's that have the the poop emoji on it. So I'm I'm voting for that one. Oh, okay. What well, about you, Bruce? Uh, uh, he's just kind of panicking. He doesn't seem to have much input. Damn it, Bruce! I'm going to persuade him. Oh boy. Okay. <laughs> what are you going to persuade him, Bruce? Look, I'm your friend, Bruce, <laughs> and we could all be friends together. But we have to work together. <laughs> What do you want me to do? Just vote. Dare. Just vote on your favorite emoji. It's not a hyper complicated oh, task. Oh no! And uh, Krylov. Krylov? <laughs> yeah. Oh, Krylarf. Krylarf. Got it. Oh, you Krylarf, speak his tongue. The Krylarf emerger. <laughs> That's actually on my sheet. I can. Oh, you. I can understand us. Do you understand anything that he's saying? <laughs> It's the dialect's hard, but the dialect's hard, but uh, nope. <laughs> <laughs> Let me get back into that accent again. <laughs> Anyways, um, I'm also going to vote for a poop emoji. Well, that's wicked funny. Wait, has everyone voted for a different emoji? Yes, we have. What was it? What was it? No, we have two no, poops, actually. Two poops. Two poops. Oh, okay. Oh, you want you want me to pull the poop emoji? <laughs> Hell yeah, brother. Do it. All right. All right. Um, so you hear like a, a distant gurgling. <laughs> oh, and no. it kind of goes like. Uh -oh. <laughs> and uh, you, you start to notice like a weird odor. And it wasn't me. <laughs> <laughs> it wasn't me. And uh, you, you kind of. Uh, yeah, you, you you just notice this. You notice that like slowly there is like brown liquid bubbling up through that grate. Oh, oh God! Well done, poop emojis. Well done. <laughs> was that was that it's wicked funny that though, right, guys? Wanted? No, it seems that the room's filling with shit. Is that not what you wanted? I don't really understand your culture here. I'm on actually on vacation. Oh. You might not know I'm actually American. <laughs> yes, I gathered that. Yeah, it's a I actually am too. Just a it's a lovely, <laughs> it's a lovely country you have here. But uh, I just I don't know how to follow the signs, and I ended up in this very strange control room. It's very dark. Well, we're gonna have to deal with that shit. Well, I mean, these hanging in implements from the ceiling. We could just swim up. <laughs> 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 Why don't we seek? Why don't we go? Well, maybe I should be clear. There's multiple positions for the levers. I pushed that one to slow. Do you want me to push it to like fast? No. no. <laughs> okay. Uh, well, okay. I'm going to just leave everything exactly as it is. I don't want to touch things if it's going to cause problems. Yes. We'll get back to you. Just uh, sit tight. 
oh, oh okay and then you, you hear the like as it hangs up again well this room's filling with shit and i don't like it vicodin is like uh what does that do again it's like a strong painkiller is it yes okay uh I'm going to drug the Australian, and if it doesn't work, I will kill him, because I want to get out of this room. <laughs> so... <laughs> yes, let's kill the Australian. <laughs> Makes sense to me. That was okay. in my head. So what's the... Oh, yes. how, you, you're going to... So you want to get to the corner where the... Yeah, like, I'm on the end, and I'm like, I see in the corner specifically this, like, thing of Vicodin, and I'm, you know, thinking, like, mm, how can I get this guy to pull down his pants? And I was like, ah, Vicodin. Vicodin. So I'm going right. to start kind of like you're, you're Clarence. my way there. Yes, Cl Clarence. Yeah, so as the furthest one from Bruce, who is sort of like he's got that chain that goes to the middle of the floor, mm -hmm. uh, you can get to the point where you can just sort of uh, reach the Vicodin um, if someone dislocates his shoulder. No, <laughs> that's horrible. <laughs> it's classic. Um, you can just sort of uh, your your fingers are like this far away from it. I start to take off my pants and uh, hold. No, wait, I have a belt here. Take the belt. <laughs> Use that to snag that Vicodin. Well, I mean, if we're going to die in a pond of shit, we might as well get high. <laughs> Actually, that's a better. Let's just all take it. All right. So one of your items is going to be a belt. Yes. All well, right. it's clothing, but yeah. Yeah. yeah it's, a ni it's a nice. Belt. Everyone else is beltless. Oh, well. You were poor. So. Yours was the same color of your pants, so they forgot to take it off of you. They couldn't oh, see it. Perfect. Well, I passed the belt down. Thank God. Here you go, gentlemen. Well, thank you. So I'm going to I'm going to take that belt and I guess kind of just form like a loop out of it and try and like drag the Vicodin to me. I mean, it's it's literally this far away. You said, yeah, so I, I feel like that that worked. That, the, that, work. okay. that that item solved your problem. OK, if I if I open it, can I like see like how much is this, how much is in it? It's it's full. It, wow. So much Vicodin. Party time. <laughs> All right. Um, Hell yes. <laughs> and also, what's the poop sitch currently? Uh, It's like it's been steadily rising. Great. So it's kind of like I mean, the whole thing is sloped to a drain, but it's probably, you know, like. A solid like foot past the grate in all the areas. So oh, if you stood so on the grate, it would be like an inch deep. Oh, so bad. But you guys are kind of at a high corner now. All right. All we right. are now that we've got the bike in. Am I right? Okay. <laughs> well, OK, before we take all the I'm, and I'm not opposed to it. I'm actually very into the idea. But since <laughs> we're here already, why don't we grab everything? Maybe there's a clue of some sort to get us out of this sticky, stinky situation. I'm pretty sure there's a goddamn clue in that Australian's goddamn butt. But sure, let's get the rest of the clues. Well, let's get all of them. And then and, and yet again, I'm not against it. <laughs> but let's just get everything first. I just like pop a Vicodin. Just OK, well, if you all have one, I want one, too. Fine, fine, fine. I'm going to pass it down. All right, I'll take a Vicodin. All right. Come on. Can I like... All right, everyone. Just, I'm like, I'm feeling kind of awkward in the corner, and I like kind of want one, but I feel awkward asking a stranger for one. And I'm like, oh, hey, what's 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 going on over there? You guys pop it to Vicodin? Ha ha! Looks like a little fun. Oh, surely it is. Would you like one? <laughs> oh god, I mean, I guess if you're offering them, thanks, so. Dad. Well, I don't fun. want to impose. Do you want it? <laughs> I yeah, I mean, if you guys are if you guys are offering, then yeah, absolutely. Can you uh, tell him yeah. how much you want it? Yes. <laughs> I, I, I mean, I just I don't I don't want it that bad. It's just like, you know, if you guys if you guys are we'll save it for later, then. <laughs> <laughs> OK. OK, so is anybody is anybody taking my kid? Yeah, <laughs> we've both taken. Yeah. OK, a second timer has started. <laughs> so if you have taken a Vicodin, um, if you don't already, I want you to become bad at reaction. That's fair. All right. And good at wisdom. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, definitely. Good at wisdom. Perfect. Sweet. All right, let's get those clues. Uh, well, when I look to my left, I see lube. When I look to my right, I see a scythe. Well, let's get them all. Well, you lube! <laughs> look to your left, now look to your right. One of those people is lube. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so I guess, yeah, we're starting heading that way. Yeah, we'll get lube, 
and then the dinosaur toy and then the side. OK, so you you took two total like bacon out of the bottle and just like, yeah, yeah. We, well, we didn't leave it there. We're well, we back. offered it to everyone, but no one seemed to really want it. <laughs> That's yeah, I mean, that's if you guys are offering again, I'll like I take some, but like I don't want to impose or like feel, you know, it's whatever. You, you hear guys a voice in the intercom. You know, the moment's gone. I wouldn't be weird about it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no, 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 it's fine. Totally, totally, totally fine. Totally fine. Let's move on. Yeah, I mean, we have a giant bottle of Vicodin, and if anyone wants to ask for some, then we'll give it to them gladly. Okay, I'm, I'm making. All right, my well, I'm gonna let's go for let's go for the scythe. All right, I'm doing it. The scythe, okay. Yeah, we got the scythe. Okay, I'm heading towards. Because yeah, like, like, I'm still on the outside, right? So I yeah, guess. Yeah, you got to grab everything. Okay, so same thing. Human chain. I'm kind of like heading towards the scythe. I'm gonna use the belt again. Can I loop the scythe with the belt? Yeah, you you chain your way over to the the scythe, and uh, it's a little bit. It's like an inch further. Um, but you feel like you could still get it with the belt. Yeah, because the other one was this far, so that one's this far. Yeah, it's that far. Gotcha. Just okay. undo one of those the holes. <laughs> it's fine. It's a little longer. All right. I, I will do this again, uh, new friends. So I'm going to throw the belts, catch the scythe, bring it in here. Now we got a scythe on top of the Vicodin. You sure do. And I'm assuming the poop is continuing to do poop stuff. Yep, yeah, it's rising at roughly the same, the exact same speed, I would say. Okay. What was in that last corner? There is loop. The dinosaur toy. No, that's no, the dinosaur toy was on a chain. <gasps> what? The dinosaur toy was on one of the chains above you. <laughs> what was the last one? There is Vicodin, Lube, Scythe, and then. Well, surely you guys were writing this down. I, I did, but toy, I right? can't read my writing. <laughs> <laughs> it's. I think it says P. Peanut butter. Peanut butter. Oh, that's peanut right. Butter, right. That's, that's what it was. That's <laughs> definitely something I wrote hours ago and have in front of me. I just heard, oh, like, so is there eight things? Like yeah. four there's, on the floor. Yeah, four there's the eight chain? things. Okay. Yeah, I wrote Panut and I didn't know what it was. Panut. Panut. That's what the kids are calling it. Yeah. Dude, you're not Panut. (laughs) (laughs) All right. Let's get all the floor stuff, I guess. All right. Should we just continue this weird thing of going in the circle? (laughs) Okay. (laughs) We crawl to the next item. (laughs) And we get it. Can we just say we have all the items? No. So when you get to the next item, (laughs) it's now like uh, a foot away from you. Foot away from foot and a half. Wow. Oh, duh. Use the side. Exactly. <laughs> uh, it's like an like an like how big is the side? Like it's an actual. I said it's like, a farming size, so it's gotta be like. No, it's right, one of those feet. ones that's like th- it's like a hand tool. Oh, that's a sickle. It's we a sickle. Were, that's what it is. We were promised a side. No, it's yeah, a sickle. That's the word I was thinking Bitch. of. All right, fine. Now, yeah, well, I'm just, okay. What uh, I'm gonna do is I'm gonna tie the belt to the sickle. Oh yeah. <laughs> and I'm gonna, cause back home. We have cows. This must be that southern sensibility I've heard so much about. <laughs> <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> All right. And this is the this is you're you're going for the peanut butter with like a lassoed sickle. Yeah. But I mean, I'm, I'm not trying to like hit it like I'm trying to slide it along the ground and hopefully use like the the sickled bit to kind of like catch it. Just sort of like hook it. If that makes sense. Like I'm pulling it towards. All me. right. I'm well, not why, don't, to, like... why don't you do? Uh, why don't you give me an agility roll on that? Are you good or bad? Oh, at I think I'm I think I made myself agile. I did. All right, oh, so roll both sets yeah. of dice. Oh, that seemed a little shady to 11. me. Eleven. Yeah, so you keep your best one. Oh, oh, oh which it's is like nine? S- no, it's yeah. eleven. Nine. Well, because I don't use five. Five and a six. What? No, no, no. Best. You keep the the best pair. Oh, gotcha, gotcha. Yeah. yeah. Okay. So that's a nine. Um. So you you manage to like get it with the sickle. But you put a big hole in the side of it. Oh, nuts. Yeah. Good thing the viscosity of peanut butter is not going to affect that much. Yeah. And uh, it start it starts leaking out like. Oh, it's the good stuff. It's like the oil on top. It seems a, like it's a clear liquid um, coming out of it. And uh, that doesn't look like peanut butter. <laughs> yeah. And it's kind of trickling toward you. Ew. Oh, no. We're being chased. <laughs> <laughs> Can I OK, I'm going to can I do a sniff test on the, yeah. liquid? Of the clear liquid? Like, liquid? Absolutely. <laughs> yes. <laughs> um, yeah. So that's going to be your I'm going to say your intelligence, whether you know what things smell like. Oh, boy. Not okay. perception. Okay. No, <laughs> no, it's smell. No, this well, is I like this is not perceiving a smell. This is like knowing a smell. <laughs> right. Yes. OK, well, I have bad intelligence. So my first roll was a seven. Oh, no. My second roll was a five. 
So seven. No, five. Yeah, it's your it's your bad one. Yeah. Um, yeah. So to you, it smells like you wouldn't want to eat it. How about I taste it? <laughs> Are you gonna taste it? So like, what do you think it is, Joe? Mama. Oh, I don't, I don't know. It's, it's kind of gross though. I uh, wouldn't go near it. Uh, it's probably, probably not, probably not good. So this, it was just, so the jar was just like marked peanut butter, and then this is the liquid that came out of it. Yeah, it was an opaque jar, and it's, it's leaking this, uh, this, this, this unfamiliar it, liquid out of it. Is it cum? Um, how are you gonna? Find I would out? like to use my intelligence. <laughs> to see if it's but like which which method of investigation are you going to use? I'm not going to say exactly why, but Hubert knows what cum looks like. <laughs> like right. You could look at it and be like, yes. Well, then that's roll. Cum. Roll exception. Are you good or bad at it? No, I'm normal. Normal? Yeah, all right. She fucking smelled it. Ah, snake eyes. <laughs> um, it looks exactly like like. Does he want it to become? Uh, <laughs> he's just. Noticing cum, he know he he notices cum. It uh, just in general. In what life. if it just like becomes what you want it to be? Like it's like the liquid of requirement, you know? Oh, <laughs> what you need it to of be? many things. Yes. <laughs> I, I sure I want it to become. <laughs> yeah. So it it looks just like um like you know when like. You know when like you come on something, and you don't clean it up right away, and it starts to lose its viscosity. Yeah, it seems like cum that's been left out. It's like drying up. Uh it's just not like as cohesive. You know. Oh, okay. All but right. it's kind of got the. It's there's a there's a there's a filminess to it. Huh. I'm I'm gonna open the jar. That's peanut butter. All right. Um, you're in. Im- you immediately notice it does not smell like anything that comes from a person. That's like very obvious. OK, and uh, that's but like I'm but the jar is, is full, full of, of this liquid. It's full of this liquid. Yeah, there's a few peanuts floating in it, but <laughs> all right, just loose, dry peanuts. Well, Bruce, it's your time to shine. <laughs> As I like, what do you what do you mean? <laughs> You're going to taste it and see what it is. <laughs> uh, no, <laughs> Bruce, ba- I'm going to try and persuade him. <laughs> yeah, you control your persuasion. <laughs> Bruce, baby, we've got to work together. Look, we're all doing our bit. Uh, uh, nine? Uh, so he, he he's like, oh, all right. And he takes like a little sip of it and immediately spits it all over all of your faces. <laughs> oh, no. And I, I dodge. I also dodge. All right. Roll agility if you want to dodge it. <laughs> Eight. I got a seven. seven. Oh, nice. It was a 12. Never mind. 12. 12. Okay, so with a. <clears throat> so these the two away, get a little so. bit like on their clothing. Oh. And you. Can you describe the motion with which you perfectly dodge this spit out liquid? Sure. Uh. Clarence B. Butterson. So it's, I guess it would be kind of like, uh, like in the Matrix. I kind of see these like globules of viscous disgusting liquid coming past and i just yeah. do a very gentle kind of like and like my little mustache just kind of flutters as the bits go by oh it like just it like flutters in the wind as yeah. like yeah. it <laughs> just clears the cum nice <laughs> and then i just straighten my bolero and go oh, my goodness are we just referring to it as the cum now even though we <laughs> I, 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 I was gonna say i don't know that you. it's cum but, <laughs> and cum. he's still like spitting onto the ground and he's like oh it's the, the, not like any cum I've ever tasted oh, fuck. but how much cum have you tasted oh come give it here <laughs> <laughs> I just take it like a, a glob of it and I taste it <laughs> alright it tastes like uh, it, it tastes like very petrochemical oh yeah Either this is a very unhealthy man, or this is... Like you also have the urge to spit it right out. I don't know if you want to, but you, that's what your instinct is. Your gut is telling you, like, spit yeah, it out. Yeah, all right. I do, but in a in a, in a uh, very, like, couth way. I, like, in a very couth way? Do you, yeah, do you like, have a handkerchief? Yeah, a handkerchief. I, like, <laughs> pull out of my pocket. <laughs> okay, roll stealth for that. <laughs> oh, do you like stealthily? <laughs> yeah. Nine? Nine? Yeah, the like um, these these two like, notice, but uh, but Bruce doesn't. Okay, 
Well, that's the opposite of what I wanted. Anyways. <laughs> well, I don't think it's come. You hear a... You hear another... It could be, voice. but I don't think it is. You hear the voice in the loudspeaker again. Okay, I've tried all the the exits, but I there's n- none of the walls will move, and nothing that looks like a door is a door, and uh, I'm kind of out of ideas. Uh, how are you doing down there? I've identified this as not cum, and <laughs> we have a sickle and some Vicodin. That tracks really well because there's like 15 jars up here and they're all labeled cum. It so. is cum. <laughs> You've got that. No, wait. Are they in peanut butter jars? No, they're in like uh, vinegar bottles. I believe he's hinting that he has all of the cum and we have the not cum. Ow. Well, it'd be strange for a man to own Who's so he? much cum and then <laughs> us not have a jar of cum. But perhaps... Oh, I suppose it must be a man that owns these. Yeah, well, you know what? I don't like to... We don't talk about these things at the dinner table, but, you know... Are you eating? (laughs) Well, you know, I managed to get some Skip the Dishes delivered here. They dropped it through a hole in the ceiling. No. (laughs) But they... they, When I asked, can you get me out? They just... I gave them my credit card, and they dropped it back, and they're gone. They didn't really... You know, it's the Uh way society is going. It's just everyone's out there for a buck. They don't want to help each other. (laughs) Yes, you can say that again. So I'm I'm thinking what I'm going to do is I'm going to. Uh, well, the, like there's a switch that says, like, exterminate uh, captives. And that's what I would like, because, like, I would I'd like to exterminate right out of here. So I think it's referring to me. I'm sorry I interrupted your uh, your weird sex party. I'm just going to flip the switch, OK? Please don't. I'm going to persuade her. <laughs> uh, what, 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 what should I do? What do you want me to do? I want you to not pull that lever that says exterminate. I got to do something. I want to push a button or I want to like turn a wheel. I, I have ADD and I need to fidget. Otherwise, I get very cranky. OK, well, don't pull that one. Uh, what other emojis did we have? The upside down face, hmm. uh, the laugh, cry laughing face. I think that's it. Right. Oh, and the the the, the straight oh, yeah. smile one. Yeah, the grimace. Yeah, there's those levers, and there's the switch that says exterminate all uh, all captives, and uh, there's some other stuff. But you're probably not interested. No, I would love to know. Maybe it could be helpful. Oh, there's lots of cum. Well, there's uh, some color coded buttons. Um, there's a green button next to a white button. Next to a purple button, uh, next to a sort of light blue button. Okay, maybe you're right. <laughs> maybe I don't care about this. <laughs> and uh, all of them have little like skulls on them. Hmm. Okay. Uh, Never mind. I don't okay. care. <laughs> Perhaps not. Do any of those colors correlate to like the clothing that we're wearing or anything? Um. No, you're all wearing beige for some reason. Oh. Like it's not like you put in a jumpsuit. It's just you all showed up wearing beige. Just by happenstance. Yeah. Oh, okay. And. Uh, yeah, that's that's the information you have on that. OK, well. Uh, and we have the dinosaur as well, or is it hanging? That, that was the dinosaur is hanging. There's stuff above you in the chains. Um, so quick question to you. Yeah. So we're, we're chained to each other. Are we like manacled to each other? Yeah, like you're, it's how? like it's like ca- you're. I'm going to say you're just handcuffed to each other. Handcuffed I think you're handcuffed to each to other, each other okay. but it appears Bruce has been chained like. Um, With some mystery part. That one end is in the grate in the, you know, where the poop is coming from. And one end is attached to his actual like. Belt thing that he's been kind of shackled with. Well, folks. And Bruce. <laughs> I didn't want it to come to this, but I think we're going to have to stick to the original plan. We got to lube them up and get those pants off <laughs> and give them Vicodin <laughs> to make it a bit. more. Wow. Palatable. You know, I got to say, I, I feel like he should be into that. If you're going to do it, there's got to be something else you can do. Why don't I just go push like, uh, I don't know, want like the white button or something and see what happens. Uh, oh, let us try this first. <laughs> 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 OK, so oh, I mean, you need something to do. Pull, uh, pull the. Which lever? The poop one gave us poop. You know, there's also some some fun (laughs) wheels in here. 
Um, what? There's uh, one with an up down arrow. There's one with a left right arrow. Can you do the d- down arrow? I don't like that. <laughs> well, maybe- well, you gotta you gotta have. Uh... <laughs> Listen, I just want everyone to get along. So maybe it's Why like the claw machine. Be- maybe. Maybe maybe we need to do the arrow, the up down arrows. You know, I, I work at the, I'm working at the mall. You know, we've got the arcade. There's the claw machine. I feel like yeah. See, it, when you include thinking. the third wheel, it's almost like it includes six kind of cardinal directions. Yes. So that was my feeling that maybe it squishes us in that direction. And <laughs> the the fourth wheel has um. It's got like it, one show is a shape that's kind of like this. And you can tell she's making a shape. And then the other one's kind of like this, if that makes sense. That's absolutely clear. Thank you for that. (laughs) Okay, you're welcome. I will not try to elaborate further since you understand. (laughs) (laughs) I feel like we're communicating really well. Honestly, I've done a lot of team building (laughs) exercises at a lot of... Uh, jobs and you know I've never done very well at them I always get yelled at but you guys seem really nice when I find well, this woman so, <laughs> so <laughs> help me my lord God. All right, I'll yes see. you're doing great <laughs> <laughs> oh thank you you know I don't get any positive reinforcement from my family they're always just telling me no you can't come to Easter no you can't come to the wedding no you can't you know uh, borrow six thousand dollars very frustrating. <laughs> I can't imagine not getting what you want. You see, in my past life, I was extremely wealthy. Oh, yes. <laughs> Did I mention I have lots of money? <laughs> oh, good. You know, uh, if I'd known that, I would have ordered more to skip the dishes. But I, yeah, I already, uh, I already did. <laughs> <laughs> well, I was hungry, but whatever. Uh. So do you really need something to do right now? Or can we go back to doing what we're doing? Oh, yeah, I'm just going to eat my enchil- my enchilada. Uh, Jesus. <laughs> Got a delicious tortilla bread. This woman's and insufferable, and I know <laughs> insufferable. <laughs> she, yeah, there's no answer. Okay. Okay, so can we not convince the Australian to remove his... Contraption. I'm going to try and persuade him again. So you're going to try and persuade him to do what exactly? Look, Bruce, we've been having a quite a good crack at it, and I'd hate to stop the momentum. So why don't you take all this Vicodin right now? Oh, all of it. Hey, that's what we're going to oh, suggest no. that he do? So, uh, <laughs> well, that's a lot. And then, I mean, we need some for ourselves. So how about four? Four Vicodins. Uh, okay, roll your persuasion. Yes. Eight. Not quite getting it. He he goes, I'll take one, because he's feeling really peer pressured. Uh, so he Can takes I, one bike in. I'm going to add my persuasion onto that, because I'm also good at it. Can I say, like, hey, man, like, be cool. We're at a party. Everyone's doing it. Like, come on. <laughs> yes. Okay, then, Everyone, yeah, then roll, we've all roll, taken roll, roll it. And like while advantage. you're doing it, like if you wanted to pass me one, that'd be cool too. <laughs> <laughs> but like no pressure. Oh, holy shit. I got okay. Well, my first roll was a 12, so I'm not. Ooh, ooh, all right. Again. Okay. Can you can you roll both those numbers for me? Um, red is going to be his resilience and green is going to be his agility. Uh, Six, seven. All right, so he he's he's shaking because he's very nervous, and Relax. he's he's taking the Vicodin out and shaking them into his hand, and he accidentally like dumps several onto the floor. You bitch! <laughs> but he and he because he got low on so he starts bawling when you do that, and he's just like not paying attention. Is just like shaking all the Vicodin. No, out. stop! <laughs> and he he like he hands like a handful over to Joe. <laughs> and there's like eight in his hand that he just slaps them in your hand and like his hands really sweaty and he lets go and yes. he's just he's just crying and he just he kept shaking them they all they're all falling onto the floor rolling into the poop no <laughs> i'm trying to catch as many as i can <laughs> all right well let's yeah that's gonna be uh let's do reaction on that one. Oh damn it oh you're worse because of the vicodin aren't you yeah, yeah. Ooh, four four you 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 save one 
Sorry? You yeah. Oh, oh, what? Yes. Save that for later. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and 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 Bruce just starts crying and he like drops the the Vicodin bottle, but like it yeah, it, it kind of goes like but Duncan rolls to your feet. Uh all right, I'm gonna take it from here because clearly you are not good at persuading. Bruce. I'm very Bruce. My little Australian buddy. I want you to look me in the eyes right now, and I want you, of your own accord, just take a little look see down your pants <laughs> and explain to us what the f- what the heck is around your waist right now. Because, boy, I don't think that's normal. Please. What's your persuasion? Let us know. I have an advantage for a persuasion, actually. All right. Oh. <laughs> he's just a fucking you a, rock. You got a seven? Uh, he's. He does like a quick look and he's like, OK. No, but <laughs> no. But what did you see? <laughs> uh, look, there's like it's what you can see. And like there's it's there's not a chain and I can feel it going down my leg and it's going into the the, the floor. What the belt? What about the belt? <laughs> it's around me. I know what a belt is. <laughs> Okay, now, now, Bruce, my my little my. What little... is it you're not understanding? Oh, so maybe maybe it's it, maybe we're just thinking that it's a um. What is that thing called? A chastity belt. What if it literally is just a metal belt? Was, was that what he's been trying to tell us? That's what time? I've been trying to tell you. But, but you haven't. <laughs> okay, well I'm telling you now. Jeez. All right, all right, my little crocodile Dundee, we are gonna get you out of there. I propose we use some of this lube, and we slip that little gator out. And we escape from here. Yeah, he needs to relax. What little gator? <laughs> you. Okay. But, oh, is he not shackled to his wrist? No, well, he's, you're, he's, you're all handcuffed to each other. Yeah. But he has like a metal belt, which is chained through his pants into the floor grate. So if we can get him like out of the floor grate. Oh, then, then we can walk around freely. Exactly. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Exactly. Lube so this when, when, Australian you, up. when you've been hitting like <laughs> your limit around when you try to get to the corners... Like the limiting factor is that that oh well but we already got the chain everything. seems to tighten mm -hmm. and it's it hits a bit of like a bit of resistance. I mean, not being chained to the floor would be smashing. All right, can we can we all lube them up together? Yes, let's do it to, as a family. But did you get the lube? <laughs> yeah, 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 we, we have it lube. all. We got all everything. No, you only got three things. What? Yeah. No, we don't have the dinosaur. No, you got the peanut butter. No, yeah. we did Vicodin size. Oh no, you're right because we were going clockwise. Yeah. Jeez. Lube. Okay, let's get the lube. <laughs> Okay, so you head to the lube corner and it's like two feet away. All right. We oh, gotta... well, that's so close. Let's just it walk is... over and grab it. <laughs> <laughs> it is. So if you if you whip the belt out, mm -hmm. it is like this far past the edge of the belt. OK. What if I let's kill him? <laughs> <laughs> um, I'm running out of ideas here. Yeah. Um, so actually, he Hear me out. Uh, okay. I watched those Saw movies, right? Those were, like, sick when they came out. And the guy had to, like, totally cut off his fucking leg. So, like, what if we just cut this Australian guy in half and then the three of us get out of here? I mean, uh, what, what? where's the shit level at? <laughs> uh, it's getting to, like, I would say it is uh, maybe, like, a four feet past its original thing. It's kind of lapping at the feet of whoever's closest in the chain that would be hubert i think what no Maybe bruce because he's attached into oh i guess hubert is just sort of like it's you're like a check mark shape if you try to fan out mm, yeah. yeah yeah so it's uh it, it would be hubert would be stepping in it if he wasn't able to kind of like pivot oh god yes let's do it <laughs> <laughs> I, 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 I like that you have any plans formulated yeah, I like that you're the Australian for, like, guy. whether or not you'll chop a guy in half is just how close your feet are to poop. <laughs> yeah, <that's> a, <laughs> disgusting. Ew. Oh. Don't they have people to clean this up? <laughs> well, there's a there's a big button that has uh you want you what you looking for cleaning? I see a big button that has a picture of a mop and a bucket on it. Oh, that's yeah, sure. I'm I can't imagine that going wrong. <laughs> What could possibly go I'm just wrong? getting really bored. I feel like I should press something. Yeah, fuck it. Press something. it. <laughs> press it. All right. So um, she she pushes the mop and bucket button and there's these like little nozzles. You kind of find the rest of the walls. I start blasting out like fire hose blasts of water. Great. Which just stirs up the shit completely and sends it in every direction. So you've just kind of like <laughs> <laughs> the shit. No. <laughs> <laughs> 
news. Turn it off. Turn it off. <laughs> Do what? Turn it off. Turn it off. <laughs> Turn it off. <laughs> Uh, man, is that, can we roll for audibility? All right, so she turns it off, and, like, the, it actually seems to have, like, um, you know, like, when you kind of, like, blast a drain and it kind of, like, loosens a bit? The, the shit seems to have, like, gone down a bit, but it's also splattered everywhere and all over all of you. Gross. I just, like, wipe my mustache. That's it! The Australian <laughs> gets it! <laughs> sure! Who oh, said that? He's giving us consent. Well, oh, the Australians give us consent to cut him in half. No, that was the that was the lady in the oh. intercom. Oh, okay. Oh. You know what? I'm just gonna say I I could never identify any of you in a police lineup. So I'm just gonna I'm gonna look in the other direction and maybe see if this like instruction manual will tell me anything. There's an instruction oh, sure. manual. What? <laughs> Oh, yeah, it's a really big book. I'm not a big fan of books. I like, uh, I like, I like more of a listen. verbal learner. Yes. Yeah, I like to watch uh, YouTube. There's a lot of, uh, you know, there's a lot of really good resources on there about how to uh, own people with facts and logic. <laughs> <laughs> Wonderful. Well, <laughs> could I pay you to read that book? Uh, how you? How are you gonna get the money to me? I, I will. I have cash on me. Okay. I'm well, allowed two things. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah. Well, I guess uh, maybe I could see if uh, maybe these these like the wheel, you know, that the applied like claw motion I told you about, and you told me you understood. Maybe I could use that to grab the money off of you. <laughs> so, are you on our side or not? <laughs> Who are you? Listen, I just want to go back to the resort. It's been a long day. You can't get out. You much... need our help. Well, <laughs> I, are you sure? You told us you couldn't. Yeah, but I'm, gonna, I'm not I'm sure gonna... you're having any more success than I am. At least I'm not covered in aerosolized shit. <laughs> yes, now whose fault was that? <laughs> you know what? It could be anyone's. It could be. Why don't you read the book? <laughs> okay, I'll start reading and she I'll hangs up. Hey, you. Okay, thank you. Look, you two I can work with. You're conversational, you're, you're, you have ideas, you're helpful in general. Which two are you looking at? Well, I'm definitely looking at uh, good old uh, Butter, Butter's Bridge. No, Butter's... Yeah, Butter's Bridge. Butter's son? <laughs> Butter's son. And Joe. And Joe. But Bruce. All right. I don't uh, know. I'm actually, I'm really, I just realized I'm good at being brave. So I am going to remove my pants, tie them to the belt, wow, tie brave. them to the scythe to make a lasso. And then I'm going to attempt to get that last item, which can I, is... Can I look at his hog? Does he have a big hog? Mine? Yes. Of course I do. You have to roll for it. No, yeah, I want you to roll for how many inches your hog is. Oh, okay. Just just roll two One. dice. Two dice. Oh, wow. Uh, yeah, why not? Four. <laughs> nice pecker. <laughs> <laughs> it is a. I was also wearing underwear. You didn't know that. Why you hear a voice no, I mean, I You know, see. it's not the size of the hog. It's how you use it. Yeah. I uh, heard that a high sodium diet <laughs> full of chicken. I'm a grower, not a shower. Thank you. High very sodium, much. high zinc. There's lots of ways to improve different aspects of your performance. Anyway, I'm gonna rope this lube. If you would all shut up. All right. Okay. I'm gonna. Uh, what would that be? That would be a, like an athletics thing. Or yeah. Something? Do agility again. Yeah. Yeah. Either way, that feels good. Ten. Yeah, it. All right, yeah. So you absolutely nail it, um, and you get the you get the bottle of lube. I look at Bruce. And I'm like, your days are numbered. <laughs> uh, yeah. Okay. So you, you've got this bottle, <laughs> and I'm gonna just start immediately go and squirt it on. Oh, do you open it? Yeah. Okay, oh, it's no. full of peanut oh. butter. Oh, come on, man. <laughs> oh, thank God. <laughs> Actually, no, oh! that's still sticky, though. Or slidey or oily. It's... Wow, there's been some <laughs> hilarious mix-up. The peanut butter's in the lube, and the lube is in the peanut butter. <laughs> Classic. I did that to one of my buddies in college. Fucking got him. <laughs> really? 
No, yeah, you were called his girlfriend was wicked mad, though, bro. It's not a great oh. move. Did they put peanut butter in her hoo-ha? <laughs> it was everywhere. Oh, no, did he put lube on his sandwich? <laughs> Which is worse. Both at the same what time. What else you should use flavored lube? It actually goes surprisingly well on a sandwich. Anyway, <laughs> how's that book coming? <laughs> oh, yeah, I found there's lots of diagrams and uh, there's lots of arrows pointing like under things and inside of things. I think there's something inside of the Australian. Some, well, it's mostly pointing at <laughs> cylinders and like pointing into it as if pointing to the very bottom of the inside of the cylinder. Who is the peanut butter? Uh, I'm holding the peanut butter. Well, technically it's lube. Can Are you sure it's lube, though? Because I thought you said it's, it like tasted like. Well, it tastes like petroleum. Yeah. It's probably a petro petroleum-based lube. Like so an oil-based lube. All right, I just thought, because you wanted to spit out immediately, and if it was lube, I just thought, you know, maybe that would be... It tasted like really rancid, whichever of you tasted it. It's just old. <laughs> so old. I mean, is it slippery when I touch it? Uh, when you touch the, the, the thing that was in the peanut butter? Yeah. Um, it's... No, it's not really slippery. It's just kind of, like, wet and smells really chemically. I don't think it's lube. But will you reach your hand down into it, please? I already did. No, to the very bottom. Oh, okay. Of the canister. Sure. I fish around in there. And uh, which which one? The 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 lube peanut butter thing. The peanut the <laughs> the one peanut marked, butter that the mystery one. <laughs> the one that was marked peanut butter. Yes. Uh, if you reach your hand to the bottom, yeah, you pull out like a small key. <gasps> oh, oh, dandy. <laughs> Uh, it's a key. Look. <laughs> uh, I you... try and unshackle mine. You try and unshackle yours? Yeah. Uh, it doesn't work. Try and oh. unshackle mine. It works. Does it? Yep. Oh, you're unshackled. Happy days. So you're, Later, you're Clarence, dude. right? Yeah. Yes, yeah, so you're totally free from the group. Thank God. Now, now run around and do something. Goodbye. <laughs> well, good luck with that. <laughs> uh, what else? We got all the items and stuff. Wait, wait. Nice. So can I can I pour out all the lube or all the peanut butter from the? Lube oh yeah, I was looking the other one. What's in the bottom in there? Oh, we check the Vicodin too. Yeah, let's check. We're gonna check out all the bottles. Okay, so in the other, uh, in the um, the, in the the one that's actually peanut butter mm -hmm. marked lube, you find uh, another key. Nice. Mm -hmm. And if you look in the Vicodin, you see a crumpled piece of paper. Oh, read the paper. Uh, it says um, milk, milk, lemonade. Round the corner fudge is made. <laughs> Push the button, pull the chain. Out comes chocolate choo-choo train. Well, we already did that. Yeah. Wait, I think that's hints for for our friend. So wait, how does it go again? So the piece of paper yeah. says milk, milk, lemonade. Round the corner fudge is made. Uh, push the button, pull the chain. Out comes chocolate choo choo train. Mm. Well, I don't know. If we're, do we want more? I don't know. I don't think we do. Does that, can I try the key on anyone? my wrist? Or on my thing? Cause we have yeah, key now, so right? the, the the other key that you found, <laughs> yeah, you you get unlocked from Bruce with the other one. Ooh! Okay. So now that we're yeah, apart, she, can we unlocked? stand on each other's shoulders yeah. and pull one of the chains. Yeah, I want the stuff. Yeah, which chain do you want to pull? Um, what, 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 what's what, up there again? So there is a bear <laughs> trap. Bear trap. A uh, a. A dinosaur. Dinosaur. Uh, there was a plastic spork. Spork. And somebody Santa wrote this hat. down, right? What? Santa and a Santa hat. Santa hat. That's right. Well, I mean, they don't look incredibly useful, but. Well, neither do you, but you've been pulling your weight. All right, Mr. I Joe, to... I say <laughs> you get up on my shoulders. I'm used to holding a lot of weight on these shoulders and you pick whatever speaks to your heart. And okay. you can leave me alone with Bruce. <laughs> <laughs> so you and Bruce are just sitting off in the corner? Well, we're shackled still, right? Yeah, you're kind yes. of in the middle, but that's where the chains are, so. Yeah. 
So before I decide which one to pull, can I just go out on a limb and ask, did anyone do anything nefarious this year that had to do with poop? Why do you ask? <laughs> just, just a regular question. And a follow-up question, if so, do any of these items speak to you directly? Well... I think that everything done with poop is nefarious. <laughs> <laughs> you hear some of the other but guys, nothing I'm really just getting whoa, into whoa, weird whoa. Bible passages about like being absolved of your sins. I don't I don't fully understand it. I hope this helps. Uh just just keep going. You're doing great. Okay. Oh god, we are in a saw situation. <laughs> oh pee and poo. <laughs> I haven't seen it. Uh. <laughs> pee and poo? <laughs> Oh, saw, um, yes, of course. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> right, Bruce, well, yeah, okay. did you do about poop? Maybe you're on oh, the right track with the sins. Mm -hmm. What what sins what? have... The poop has started the, rising again, though. Oh, the, the poop is coming. <laughs> <laughs> has anyone done anything nefarious with poop? No. Or bear traps? Lube? Peter butter? If you don't like Bruce. the poop, I could just turn that lever back off. Oh, Jesus. Yes, please. Do. Okay, so she flips it and then the, the poop just stops. Oh. <laughs> I did think of that a long time ago, but I was like, no, surely not. Was that an but there is a poop the puddle in the middle right under the chains. Like, it has, it doesn't drain, it just stops. Oh, great. Yeah. <laughs> Shit, Bruce. Shit, Bruce. Bruce. Shit. Bruce is just crying. And he's like, because he, he took Vicodin, right? Yeah. So yeah, he's couple. really zonked. He's just okay. kind of like staring off at Well, what space. I'm going to do then is I'm going to, um, you know, like when. When you're trying to be a gentleman, so you lay down in a puddle and you let a lady walk across you. Sure. All the time. All the time. <laughs> I'm, I'm going to take Bruce and just kind of like roll him over so he's on the puddle and then use him to kind of stand on. And then that way I can get Joe on my back without dirtying my. Feet. OK, you do that. that <laughs> take it, Bruce. <laughs> <laughs> face down or face up? Um, <laughs> he's kind of face sideways, like two face. Yeah, he's fine. <laughs> and he's just like, kind of like blubbing, but he's, he's fine. He's fine. He's fine. <laughs> Oh no! <laughs> All right, Joe, what's up there? Uh, I feel like I feel like we gotta. What do you guys think? Dinosaur? Dinosaurs are cool. Dinosaur right? seems safe to me. I don't know. What do you think? Mm -hmm. I suppose. Yes, the dinosaur. Sure. Okay. Pulling, Surely. Pulling the dinosaur. I'm gonna yank the dinosaur chain. Ooh. All right. So you pull the dinosaur chain. And uh, Hubert just like collapses, <gasps> uh, just dead. What? Yeah. What? Oh. Yeah, like uh, no! a little. Um, <laughs> how describe describe the the fucked up way you die? Uh, I'm holding the sickle as a well. I'm holding everything as they go up. Mm hmm. And I like, ugh, I die and I like drop everything. I kind of like fall over. Um, and the sickle uh, stabs Bruce in the leg. Okay. Yep. And I fall on top of it. All right. And on top of Bruce. So you keel over dead on top of Bruce. I'm dead. Who you've lightly wounded. Yes. Okay. So I'm just going to go out on a limb here and say there's nothing here worth saving. And I think the two of us should try and just break down this door and get the hell out of here. I think you are a hundred percent right. Also, oh, the... something came up on my screen. Oh no! <laughs> there's some sort of uh, <laughs> explanation. There's a wow. There's a really sordid story coming up, and uh, I, I'm gonna skim over the details. But wow! Oh my gosh! I can't believe someone would do this. Uh, basically, it says this is what you get, Hugh. But this is what you get. <laughs> For what you did with my dad behind the dinosaur at the at the mini golf. <laughs> well, I, I guess it'll be a happy. mystery forever. Yeah. That's right. That's a that's a very cool thing, a poignant thing to say after he's already dead and can't hear you <laughs> yeah, anymore. Right? Yeah. Really <laughs> rub Listen, that I in his face. I didn't, I didn't set up this puzzle. I just am starting to notice. Oh, maybe the dinosaur symbolized something. All right. Well. I feel like if we were to pull any of those things from the roof down, they seem to uh, symbolize us and we will die horribly. So I would prefer not to do that. 
Yeah, the rich I'm, gentleman I'm, is dead. I'm, on that. I'm gonna take his money too, just from his pocket. Yeah, you do that. Thank you. Cool. Cool. Um, so we're unshackled. So are we just gonna? I'm gonna. I'm gonna hack at the door with a sickle. Yeah. And uh, you, you get a, you see a rare moment of lucidity from the uh, from Bruce, where he goes, "Oh, oh no, oh no, oh no! The symbolism, not the, oh no." Not the yogi hentai. Not the bear. Please don't. I believe that man's a bear trap. Should we put him out of his misery? (laughs) Yeah, I mean, he did just get stabbed. Or I don't know why. Talking with Southern accent. He did just get stabbed, and I hear that uh, (laughs) sepsis is, like, wicked bad. So let's let's just (laughs) give him the See, I was thinking the same thing. He he doesn't stand a chance, honestly. I just, like, immediately pick up Joe and start to, like, hoist him onto my shoulders. Yeah, I, I pull the bear trap with, <laughs> with no hesitation. Okay, you pull the bear trap? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, so the bear trap um, flies down almost like like a homing missile. Oh, God. Onto <laughs> Bruce. Yes. As you dive out of the way, and it just snaps on his head and crushes it like a grape. Well, and, that's the best uh, possible way this could have ended for him. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> it's better than being cut in half, probably. All right, now we here- flash cut to hell. <laughs> <laughs> wow, another story on my screen. Oh my god! I listen. I can't even. This is definitely not. I oh, I hope this doesn't get on my phone. Uh, this looks like some very illegal pornography. But um, yeah. Oh, it's and it says like the the key to the bear trap was inside you all along, you pervert. That's what that's what it says. Fucking knew it. We should have cut him in half. There was something in the Australian. I knew it. (laughs) Uh, yeah. I, I, you see me turn over. (laughs) (laughs) Yeah, and as you as you turn over it, uh, it 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 shifts Bruce's shirt a little bit, and you see a very fresh looking scar, kind of like on his lower back. Well, he's dead, so I don't think consent is of a matter at this point. Mm. Yeah, I'm that's, gonna that's take fair. his shirt off <laughs> and look at that cut thing. Yeah, it's like a very fresh, very poorly stitched wound on his like lower back. Would you uh, pass me the scythe, please? Here, yeah, here you go. Thank you. Get thank on you. in there. I'm going to just go for a little dig in there in, in the Australian, just kind of like I'm cutting a roast, like a nice piece of chicken and see what I can find. Uh, or she would have an advantage in this. In cutting chicken, yes. Yeah, yeah. so you you cut it right open and um, as, you, as you pull the um, as you kind of pull the scythe through him, it pulls out like a hard foreign object hmm. and it Ooh. is uh, it is a uh, a resort key card and uh there's there's a uh, like a cry laughing emoji stamped on it ah hmm do we do we do we get the 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 lady in the in the big room up there to press the cry laughing emoji or do you think I mean, that's going to get us dead but i don't can we like try the, those? What did those doors look like again? Or you said it looked like doors that had been like sealed shut, correct? Um, yeah, they've been like screwed shut. All right. And I can't use the spork or I will die. Yeah, let's talk to the lady. Let's call a friend. She's not a friend. Though. Already on it. And she just hits the cry laugh <laughs> oh, <no>. emoji <laughs> switch. Yeah, a uh, like a false wall falls down opposite the regular doors. And you see like a very futuristic looking sliding door with a little like tap pad next to it. My stars! <laughs> We're gonna get that <laughs> out of this hellhole. <laughs> oh, Did you guys sick. reveal your secrets? This is like some James Bond shit. Hell yeah. And we are like Bonnie and Clyde. But oh great, we- that looks like a door. Listen, once you get out, can you come up here and help me get out? Yeah, yeah, we'll get right to that. Um Absolute. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm booking it for the door at this point. I I want to get out of here. Okay. Mm-hmm. 
So you head for the door. I step on both of them on my way out. They squish as you step on them. Because I can. <laughs> um, do I st- I'm going to still bring like the scythe and stuff with me, you though. as well. And the key card. And I'm going to try the key card on the futuristic door. Yeah, it opens a futuristic door and it uh, opens to a nice little like locker room with some uh, some clean jumpsuits and some showers. Oh, hell yeah. I think I have a nice little shower, I think. I'll oh, that's great. The that jumpsuit me. down there that looks like it'll fit me. That last switch worked really well. I'm going to start pushing all the buttons hey, and flipping I'd the switches. Hey, I'd rather you didn't. Oh, but she's already done it, hasn't well, she? Well, I'm about to. So, you know. How about you give me a sec? What was her name? What was your name? Susan. <laughs> Susan? My name's Susan, yeah. If you could just wait a s- Lost the accent. If you could just wait a second there, I'm about to find you a nice little jumpsuit to put your little tushy in. So just- Well, you'd me. have to leave the, the weird uh, torture chamber to do that. Are you going to walk through the door? I'm working on it. I'm working on it right now. Does it literally just lead into this locker room and that's it? Yeah, it's a locker room and then you're outside of the room. Okay. No, we are out though, right? Like we're Oh, do you do you walk in? Yes. Alright, do you walk out? Maybe. Nicole? This seems like a trap. <laughs> Is it? Yeah. Is it a trap two hours and six minutes in? <laughs> <laughs> yes, I walk out. Alright, so just as you uh finish walking out. Um, you hear her go, okay, you know, uh, eeny, meeny, miny, mo, and she starts pushing buttons and like buzz saws start flying through the room behind you. And it starts like, uh, sparks come down and it ignites the, uh, the, what you thought was come, but it's actually kerosene. Oh, geez. Whole room's huh? on fire. And then eventually the door snaps shut. Uh, Joe? J- 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 Joe? Joe? <laughs> Joe? And, uh, yeah, so you kind of collect yourselves <laughs> and, uh. <laughs> On uh, on your way out, um, there's there's a like, you know, once you've showered up and changed and you see like an arrow says back to resort and uh, you you see a door um, on your way out that has a sort of like it's got one of those little like submarine hatch wheels on it. And yeah, that wheel, it's marked just like control room and it looks like. It looks like somebody kind of like put a shoe in the doorway, but that shoe slipped out and the door snapped shut. Mm. I um, wedge the shoe back under the door and I additionally take the scythe and shove it across so that when you try to turn it, it just does not. Work oh, so you're all. like locking the door more. Yes. All right. And then, uh, yeah, you head out and you return to your vacation. And uh, I don't know, do you tell your family about what happened or? That was the sickest escape room I've ever been in, bro. That was so cool. I got to admit, I had a nice time. That's a little too bad about <laughs> our friends, but that's just life. <laughs> Nothing that's, a good biscuit won't fix. That's true. Do you part your separate ways without ever revealing your secrets? <laughs> yes. <laughs> Absolutely. Well, yes. I think the only thing left for tonight is for Nicole to make a nice... Nice <laughs> to uh, just lean right into her mic and uh, show us what uh, good pussy smells like. Sounds like. <laughs> <laughs> wow. <laughs>